Hello everyone, and welcome to an early look at gameplay in Monster Hunter Rise on Nintendo Switch. Monster Hunter Rise will take you to vast new locales where you can hunt a variety of unique monsters. Luckily, you'll be equipped with various ways to explore your surroundings, find your prey, and take it down. Let's introduce you to our new canine companion, the Palamute. With the help of these highly trained hounds, hunters can cover terrain faster than ever, and even use items during their exploration. Hunters are able to boost stamina, sharpen weapons, and drink potions to stay prepared for the challenges ahead. Today, our hunt takes place in the Shrine Ruins, a once sacred land now overtaken by nature. The mountainous ranges lead to breathtaking vistas, but can prove to be quite the challenge to conquer. Thankfully, hunters are equipped with the new Wirebug. This trusty Wirebug will unlock a new layer of vertical mobility, allowing you to reach new heights and discover endemic life to help you on your hunt. Endemic life can be found by exploring the nooks and crannies of peaceful spots, or even amidst dangerous monster territory. Interacting with these living creatures will give hunters a variety of bonuses, such as increased stamina, defense, attack, helpful items, or additional wire bug charges. With our hunter fully prepped and ready to battle, it's time to hunt down our target the peculiar bird wyvern, Agnason. Upon finding our prey, the Palamids quickly engage in battle and take the role of active fighters during the hunt. The Great Sword is a weighty weapon type capable of delivering meaty chops to unsuspecting monsters. Great Sword wielders have to plan their attacks very carefully in order to take advantage of the weapon's devastating charged slashes. Hunters are prone to taking knocks, but with quick reflexes and a well-timed use of the wirefall technique, they can jump right back into action. Thanks to the wire bug, hunters are able to utilize these threads without a moment's hesitation to enhance their mobility on the hunt. With Agnesom now enraged, its attacks are faster and deadlier than before. Our hunter needs to tread very carefully. Our hunter attempts to get the upper hand by utilizing a new Wirebug Greatsword move called Hunting Edge. With a tactical retreat and the use of a Mega Potion, our hunter escapes defeat by the skin of their teeth. The Tackle is a valuable asset in the Greatsword user's arsenal, allowing you to withstand fierce blows and access various combo routes, such as a shortcut to the iconic True Charged Slash. Using the wire bug, our hunter takes to the skies and harnesses gravity to deliver a powerful multi-hit attack, the Plunging Thrust. Each weapon type now has Wirebug assisted moves added to their toolkits. However, careful management of their cooldowns is paramount. These newfangled abilities all rely on a shared pool of Wirebugs. And here, a hunter dodges Atlasom's fiery assault with the Power Sheath. A swift evasive move that also boosts the hunter's attack power for a short period of time.
Akmasom is retreating to another area of the Shrine Ruins, so we'll wrap up our hunt here. We hope you've enjoyed an early look at some of the new gameplay features coming to Monster Hunter Rise. Stay tuned for more info on Monster Hunter Rise coming soon. The hunt begins on Nintendo Switch, March 26, 2021.